While we're all excited for the big game, the Super Bowl is nothing without its traditions. From the coin toss to the halftime show, it's these other events that make the Super Bowl the spectacle that it truly is. I'm here at Luke Air Force Base learning about another tradition, the flyover. Every Super Bowl, the different military branches trade off who will have the honor of performing the flyover. This year, it's the Navy's turn and will feature an all-female flight crew. Lieutenant Lindsay Evans is one of the eight members of the crew. So this year marks 50 years of women in naval aviation. There was eight women that were selected in 1973 to be the first uh, group that went through flight school. Spectators will see four jets this year, two FA-18s, one Growler, and one F-35. The jets will take off from Luke Air Force Base and will take only five minutes to get to the stadium and they'll be 750 feet above the fans in a diamond formation. Honestly, just what looks cool. To pull off the flyover successfully takes precision. All of the pilots have practiced the flight and have years of experience, but they'll only be a couple feet away from each other. That's where Lieutenant Catherine Martinez comes in. Actually, what's kind of cool is I'll get to see all three other of uh, the other aircraft. Um, so it is my pilot's job to fly the jet and fly in formation, and then it is my job to tell other jets to get into formation. So. The crew is ready to show off what their years of training have taught them and why they were chosen for this flyover that's 50 years in the making. For WEBN Sports, I'm Drake Skelly.